Hey guys. Oh. Hey guys. Hi. Hey guys. Hey guys. My name is Marla, and this is my channel, Marla Catherine. Catherine's my middle name. Marla Catherine. But on my channel, I like to make some fashion videos, and today's fashion video is going to be about taking graphic t-shirts and styling them. So I give you guys 10 outfit ideas on how you can style a graphic t-shirt. I wanted to film this because I feel like everybody has graphic t-shirts. Like, everyone just has t-shirts. It's just like a closet essential, I feel like. I do a lot of fashion videos, but like, honestly, who's always being fashionable? You know, like a lot of the times I gravitate towards graphic tees because they're super easy to put on and just to wear. That concludes this intro. I don't like it when intros are like so long and boring and useless. So without further ado, I'm gonna stop talking. Actually, I'm gonna be doing a voiceover, so I'm gonna be talking still, but I'm gonna end this intro now. Let's go. So first up, these are my favorite stores to buy my graphic tees from. There's Bershka, Urban Outfitters, Brandy Melville, Desert Dreamer LA, Target, and Thrifting My T-shirts. I will have all the links to all the clothing pieces in the description box down below, so you can check that out if you want to know where everything's from. Okay guys, first graphic tee of the day is this one from Dedicated. It's a screen capture from the movie E.T. I don't know if you've heard of it. It's like a super low budget indie film, but it's really cool. Also another fun fact is that my sister bought me this shirt from Copenhagen, so I feel so cool when I wear it. So basically my dummy proof formula for fashion dummies like me is adding prints and denim plus a graphic tee equals really tubular outfit. So that's basically what this is. Another tip is pairing high-waisted pants with a cropped denim jacket or a cropped jacket of any form because it just helps to cinch in your waist and to give you more of a like a silhouette instead of drowning yourself in clothing. This next outfit is gonna be called Crans or Cool, and it's just basically where you take a pair of colored pants and you pair it with your graphic tee. This is definitely like a very playful outfit and you can switch things up with the colors and this entire outfit is from Brandy Melville, the belt, the pants, the shirt, and the bucket hat. You can definitely have fun with this and switch up the colors of your pants. This next outfit is inspired by Peter Pan, and I don't even know if that makes sense, but I've always like associated collars with Peter Pan. I don't know why, but take your graphic tee and you layer a collared t-shirt underneath it. That way you can pop out the collar and you can just give it like an extra detailed effect. It really is simple, but it does make your outfit look a lot more chic and like put together. And I just paired my golf t-shirt with some red Converse, the collar, and some Hollister jeans. Modest is hottest. Um, this is a life motto I try to go by. <laughs> this outfit is just where you take a graphic tee and you layer it underneath a dress that has like straps. I like to pair denim dresses with graphic tees. I think it gives it really cute like picnic vibes and it's really good for school or for even church or whatever occasion. You can really dress it up or dress it down. I personally styled mine with a bandana and some sneakers I found from the thrift store. So I'm very aware that Visco is a photography app, but everybody's been making these like Visco type videos, like Visco girl transformations. It's where they wear oversized t-shirts, have hydro flasks, and wear denim shorts and Birkenstocks. So that's literally what this outfit is. It's taking an oversized t-shirt and pairing it with some denim shorts and Birkenstocks. What a shocker. But this is a really good lazy day summer outfit if you just aren't in the mood to like It's also a really good up. way to style your oversized t-shirts even if you want to like grab some from your dad's closet. This next outfit is called the after party. This one, I named it this because I feel like it's a very versatile outfit that you can wear to a dinner party and then you can go to your friend's house afterwards and it would still like fit. But it's where you take your denim t-shirt and you scrunch it up over a dress and then you tie it right like above your waist into a knot like so and this is just super it can like look super casual it's honestly just however you styled it i also paired it with some of hannah maloche's starlight village jewelry and then i also paired it with some white air force sneakers so it really is such a versatile outfit and it's probably one of my favorites So this next one is called the dress code and this one is very appropriate for school for really any occasion. There's also a stain on my bodysuit, but let's just pretend that's not there. But you really can mix up the patterns and prints with your graphic tee and your bodysuit and you can have fun with it. I paired mine with some light wash denim jeans and some Nike Air Forces. These sunglasses are from Urban Outfitters and then the earrings that I'm wearing are little honeybees and they're from Choker Jewelry. Then my belt is from Brandy Melville. It's like a translucent pink. I just think this looks really rad and it's just like a really good, almost, it's like a futuristic type vibe, but I really like it. 
So next up is Cosmic Wonder. This one is just a green t-shirt. You can honestly call this one like the artsy aesthetic look. It's where you just take your t-shirt and you tuck it into a pair of ultra high-waisted pants. And then I paired it with a cheetah belt that I have from Brandy Melville and the tag is sticking out. That is embarrassing. And then I paired it with some Vans. So it's like the epitome of those niche memes you see on Instagram. And this one is called Sunday School. I titled it this because once again, it's one of those versatile outfits you could wear to church if you really dressed it up. Or you can wear it to school or you can just wear it while you're laying in bed watching Netflix. It's really, you know, that was such like a, I'm relatable. <laughs> Denim skirts are such a good go-to when you're trying to style your t-shirts. This one's just one. This t-shirt's from Urban Outfitters and it's a Beatles one. I love the Beatles. Comment down below if you've seen the Yesterday movie and what you guys thought. I kind of liked it. I don't know. I feel like I was on the fence. Last but certainly not least is Yes Sir. This one's just where you take army green pants and you style it with like an edgy chain or your t-shirt or whatever, but it's kind of like a more masculine looking outfit, but it's very cute and it can be styled up or down however you want. Army green pants are also, I feel like, very accessible. Like they are sold at most stores. So the belt and the pants are from Brandy Mobile and then I styled it with some bands and some rings. That was the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and you like learned something new or you at least had fun watching it or it was background noise while you're getting ready for your day. Whatever it may be, I hope you guys liked it. Give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe for more videos like this. I make, I feel like I've been, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Just subscribe if you want to. I will see you guys in my next vid. In the description box down below, I'll have links to all of the graphic tees that I used in the video. And if you have any questions about like where I got certain clothing items from. I'll do my best to reply in the comments. So with all that being said, I think I'm gonna say peace and I'm gonna go leave and probably eat some food. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Hopefully that wasn't focused.